Hello everyone. Today I am going to tell how to find missing frequencies in median problems. This is first problem. Calculate the missing frequency from the following distribution. It being given that the median of the distribution is 24. So here this table is given. In this table A is in years uh, 0 to 10, 10 to 20, 20 to 30 like this. And number of persons between 0 to 10 years, uh, the number of persons are 5 persons and between 10 to 20 years, 25 persons. Like this, uh, it is given and here we have to find this mi missing frequency. So here between 20 years to 30 years, so how many number of persons we have to find? That is the frequency we have to find here. And first, uh, write this table in column wise. And uh, here median is given that is 24. So let the missing frequency be x and write the table in column wise as in years and number of persons. So this is frequency 0 to 10, 10 to 20 like this you have to write and here like this and here missing frequency we have assumed as x. So write here and uh, now you have to find cumulative frequency to find this x. You have to apply the values in the median formula. Uh, to apply the values in the median formula you have to find cumulative frequencies. We know that cumulative frequency means here the number of persons between 0 to 10 years, the number of persons are 5 and up to 10 years it is 5 and here 10 to 20 years between these two numbers, the number of persons are 25 persons and but up to 20 years, the number of persons are 25 plus 5 that is 30. So this is called cumulative frequency. Again, you see here between 10 to 20 years, the number of persons are 25. But up to 20 years, the number of persons, including this persons also, 0 to 10, between 0 to 10 years also, that persons also. So 25 plus 5, that is 30. Like this, you have to add the frequencies to get the cumulative frequencies. And uh, here 30 plus x, 30 plus x, this is the cumulative frequency here. And again, 30 plus 18, that is 48 plus x. And you have to add again 48 plus 7, that is 55 plus x. This is up to 50. Up to 50 years, the number of persons are 55 plus x. So this is uh, n value. And uh, here the median is given, that is 24. So 24 is between the class interval 20 to 30 years. So that number is 24 is between these two numbers. So you have to take the class interval as 20 to 30. So the lower limit L is equal to 20 here. And uh, this is the frequency, this is the frequency x and cumulative frequency is the preceding median class frequency, cumulative frequency that is 30. So you have to take CF as 30 and F as x and L is 20 and N is 55 plus x. So right here all the values, N is number of observations that is 55 plus x and L is lower limit of the median class that is 20 and CF is 30 and h is class interval that is 30 minus 20 that is 10. 50 minus 40, 40 minus 30 that is the class interval and frequency is x. So now substitute these values in the median formula. We know that median is equal to L plus n by 2 minus Cf by f into h. So here median is given that is 24 is equal to L is lower limit. So substitute these values 20 plus n is 55 plus x by 2 minus 30 CF is 30 by X into 10. Now you have to find X value here. So here 24 minus 20 is equal to 55 plus X by 2. Here 2 into 30 that is 60 by 2 X into 10. So So 2x into 10. Now 2 ones are 2 fives are 10. Then 24 minus 20 is 4 into x. That is equal to 55 minus 60 is minus 5. x minus 5 into this 5. 5 into x minus 5. Now 4x minus 5x is equal to 5 into minus 5. That is minus 25. So minus x is equal to minus 25, therefore x is equal to 25. That is the missing frequency, that is 25. This is another type of problem. 
Calculate the missing frequencies from the following distribution if the median is 46 and the total number of items is 230. So here the table is given like this and here we have to find these two missing frequencies. So these two values are not given, frequency values are not given. So you have to find these two values. And here median is given that is 46 and total number of items that is n is equal to 230. So you have to assume these two missing frequencies be x and y and write this table in column wise like this. And these are the frequencies and these two are x, y values you have to find. And first to find the cumulative frequency, uh, frequency values for that first this is 12 and 12 plus 30 is 42 and 42 plus x is 42 plus x like this and if you add 65 plus 42 107 plus x plus y 107 plus x plus y like this and here this is 150 plus x plus y is total number of items that is 230 that is given in the problem 230 so here you have to find two values two variable values so for that you, you need at least two equations to solve these two missing frequencies, two variables x, y. So first equation is 150 plus x plus y that is given that is 230. So x plus y is equal to 230 minus 150 that is 80. So this is first equation. In second equation you will get uh, by substituting the values L, F, CF values uh, and by two all the values in the median formula because median value is given. So first write uh, as the median is given that is 46 it is between the class interval 40 to 50. 46 is between these two numbers. Okay. So this is the class in, class interval 40 to 50 and this is the L value lower limit and this is frequency 65 and CF is 42 plus X. So this is CF this is an N is 230 that is already given. So substitute these values. Write all the given values here. H is 50 minus 40, that is 10. Now substitute all the values in the medium, median formula. Median is given, that is 46. So substitute like this. Then here 46 minus 40 is equal to, here 230 by 2 is 115 minus 42 plus X by 65 into 10. So 2 13s, 5 13s are 65 and 5 2s are 10. And... Uh, so here 46 minus 40 is 4 into 13 is equal to 115 minus 42 is 73 minus minus into plus minus 6 into 2. Now for 52 is equal to 2 into 73 is 146 minus 2x. If you calculate x value that is equal to 94 by 2 that is 47. So once you find x value substitute this value in the first equation that is x plus y is equal to 80. Then y is equal to 80 by 40, 80 minus 47, that is equal to 33. Therefore, missing frequencies are 47 and 33. If you substitute these two values uh, in n 150 plus x plus y, that is 230, you can check like this. This is a different type of problem. Find the missing frequencies and the median for the following distribution if the mean is 1.46. So in this problem, the mean value is given that is 1.46 and uh, we have to find missing frequencies and median value. So this is the table given here. So here we have to find the median value, median of uh, this data, number of extents and uh, frequency number of days that is also given here. So here 46 and these two values are not given. These are the missing frequencies we have to find. And total number of days, that is n, that is the number of observations, total number of days. So this is n value. So these two values are given mean and n value. And this data is also given. By using this, we have to find missing frequencies and median value. So right here, mean is equal to 1.46 and n is equal to 200. And these two missing frequencies, so you have to assume as X and Y. So first write this data in column wise. So here, the, these are the number of accidents, 0, 1, accident, 2 accidents like this. And number of days. So in 46 days, the accidents are 0 like this. So this is the data. And these are the missing frequencies, X and Y. And number of accidents, you can assume as T. So here first median val mean value is given. So you have to find uh, frequency into this value. This is P, F into P. 
So first multiply. First multiply uh, this number of days into number of accidents. Then 46 into 0, that is 0, and 1 into x, x, 2 into y, 2y, 3 into 25, 75, like this. You have to multiply. This is FV values. Now, you can find CF values, cumulative frequency values also, because uh, this is for mean calculation and this is for uh, me median calculation. You have to find cumulative frequencies. So, uh, cumulative frequencies here are, you have to take this frequency, 46, and add 46 plus x, that is 46 plus x, and 46 plus y plus x, this is 46 plus x plus y, like this, 46 plus 25, that is 71 plus x plus y, like this, you have to add, these are the cumulative frequencies. Now, here mean value is given, we know that mean is equal to sigma fp, here p is number of accidents. So, F is frequency. So, sigma Fp by sigma F. Sigma F means the total number of days. That is already given. That is 200. So, here sigma F is n value. 200. This is given in the problem. And if you add this uh, number of days, that is sigma F. 86 plus X plus Y. This is 200. This value is 200. That is given in the problem. So, here sigma F is n. And find sigma fp. So sigma fp means you have to add all these values. Okay. So if you add all these values, you will get 140 plus x plus 2y. Here see x plus 2y. If you add these numbers, you will get 140 plus x plus 2y. Okay. Now here sigma f is equal to 86 plus x plus y is equal to 200. This is given. This is n value. By using this, you can find x plus y is equal to 200 minus 86, that is 114. So, this is first equation. Here, you have to find two variables. So, you need at least two equations. So, this is uh, one equation. And by using mean value, you can find another equation. So, mean value is given. So, that is equal to sigma fp by sigma f. This is the formula for mean. And 1.46 mean value is 1.46, that is equal to sigma fp. Can see from here this is mean value and sigma fp is 140 plus x plus 2y so right here 140 plus x plus 2y by sigma fp is nothing but n value this is n value so that is uh, sigma f so write 200 now cross multiply here 200 into 1.46 is equal to 140 plus x plus 2y now x plus 2y is equal to here this value is 292 minus 140 that is 152 now substitute uh, in this equation x value here from this x is equal to 114 minus y so substitute this, that value here 114 minus instead of x 114 minus y plus 2y is equal to 152 now 2y minus y that is y is equal to 152 minus 114 that is 38 therefore x is equal to 114 minus y that is 38 so that is equal to 76 this is from 1. Now, x and y values are missing frequencies, 30, uh, 76 and 38. Therefore, missing frequencies here. You can write. This is 76 x and y. So, missing frequencies are. You can write in an order. So, 76 and 38. These are the missing frequencies. And we have to find median value also. So here you can directly find median value. And by two, this is 200, n is 200. So 200 is an event number. So n by two observation is the median value because here the class intervals are not given. Directly you can find this median value. So n by two is 200 by two, that is 100. So if you see from this table, you have to see the cumulative frequencies here. So here this is 46 and this is 46 plus x value just now we got that is 76. This is 122. So this is 122. If you see these are the cumulative frequencies, these are the cumulative frequencies. So 100 is n by 2. That is the 100th observation. So near to uh, this 100 is not there. So near to this number or greater than 100 that is 122. So you have to See this number. 
and uh, this is the median now. So this is 122. So the median is here number of extents. Uh, here the median is corresponding to this number 122 is 1. So this is the median value 1 accident. Okay. So therefore median is equal to 1 because this is greater than 100th observation and nearest to it. That is 122. 122 cumulative frequency 122 so that is the median value uh, corresponding that 122 cumulative frequency the number of accidents uh, is one so median is one you can see again from here this is 122 so corresponding is one so like this you have to find median values by using if you know mean values now please do this uh, similar question Here median is given, you have to find missing frequencies. You have to missing frequencies here. These are the answers. 